Hi, my name's James Orby. I'm a former student at Loughborough University. I graduated last year. Um, it seems like a long time ago with everything that's been going on. But um, I uh, studied chemistry at Loughborough as well as uh, was part of the swim team. Um, I now am still based in Loughborough. Um, I'm a, a full-time swimming. Um, but when I came to the university a number of years ago now, my, my intention was to balance academics and sport equally and kind of maximise uh, both of those whilst I um, had time at Loughborough. Um, my, my outc the outcome you know, my degree I was really happy with and um, I've been fortunate enough to be able to continue uh, swimming at a high level. I, I joined the university at kind of a high-end-ish national level and um, was able to make a few international teams and even win a few medals um, whilst studying uh, chemistry. I think the the main thing, main takeaway almost from me and that whole experience over the years was I, I learned the value of support from staff and, and people across different departments. Uh, so Loughborough Sport and, and, you know, the Department of Chemistry and the School of Science in that when you kind of work with as many people, you know, the people that you need to work with um, to kind of build up a good network around you, you, you can quite easily achieve um, quite a few things. So for me, it was international level sport, um, which I'm sure, you know, sport is a big common thing for Loughborough and, and many people potentially want to come to Loughborough University will be wanting to also do sport. But yeah, for me, it was international sport and studying at the same time. And that's, you know, not an easy task. It was um, presented many challenges along the way, but the, the support that I received was absolutely crucial to enabling me to achieve what I achieved in my degree as well as achieving what I did um, when it came to you know swimming internationally and um, yeah when I when I initially was picking universities I was you know deciding between a few and in the end I settled on Loughborough because I, I felt like that was going to be the best fit for me and how I kind of wanted to 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 you know, go about things into the course and and the swim team and all that. And um, I, you know, I look back on that decision to choose Loughborough, and it's probably one of the best decisions I have made in my life because I came um out of the the six years studying with you know this amazing degree from a fantastic university. You know, just purely academically speaking, but also was able to you know move on my sporting career to then whole like you know whole another le level and continue doing that as you know my full time occupation effectively now. So. Yeah, really just immensely grateful for all the support that I received. And, you know, speaking, if I would be speaking to any prospective students, um, that that would be the main thing that I would say. If, if you want to choose Loughborough and you feel like, you know, sport and academics, even if it's not sport and academics or just academics, but, you know, that, that whole thing, Loughborough, appeals to you, do not write it off because Loughborough is definitely one of the best decisions I made and it could definitely be one of the best decisions you make because um, the, the support network, like I said, is fantastic and the academic facilities are incredible as are the sporting facilities. So yeah, I'm, I'm definitely biased, but um, it's very easy uh, to say once you, you go through it and you experience it because you know what you put in, you can definitely get so much out. Um, and uh, yeah, definitely would recommend it. Um, and that's kind of <laughs> what I have to say on that. But um, yeah, hope you enjoy uh, potentially coming to Loughborough or visiting Loughborough, whatever's allowed during this open day. But yeah, that's me. Thanks.